In today's video, we're going to talk about all the Wi-Fi connection issues on your iPhone XR. Now, many users who have upgraded their iPhone XR to iOS 18, right after that, some users are getting unable to join error when they're trying to connect to their Wi-Fi. But once they're connected, sometimes the signal seems to be really poor, it's showing connected but no internet, and sometimes the connection is slow and their Wi-Fi keeps disconnecting at random. So let's go ahead and fix all these issues. Since it's an older model, you have to make sure your iPhone is near to your router. So when this happens, just go ahead, turn off Wi-Fi, turn on airplane mode and simply restart your iPhone. Press and release the volume up and down button and press and hold the side button till the screen goes black. And meanwhile, you know what, if it's possible for you, give your router a restart as well. If the issue still persists, let's go ahead and check out some screen time settings. From settings to screen time to content and privacy restrictions, you can turn off content and privacy restrictions all the way or you can just scroll down to wireless data and make sure it's selected to allow. Now, another important thing to check out when you're having Wi-Fi issues is if the lockdown mode is on on your device or not. To check that out, go ahead and open up settings from their privacy and security lockdown mode if you see it's turned on just go ahead turn it off and then just go ahead tap on turn off and restart and also whatever network you're having the problem currently just go ahead from its settings forget the current wi-fi and then reconnect with it once again and talking about reconnecting unable to join occurs when the wi-fi password has changed but you might have been putting down the old password so if that's your case, make sure you're putting down the correct password. And it's recommended not to use Wi-Fi and cellular data at the same time. If you're still having the same issues, just go to your Wi-Fi settings and somehow if it's showing low data mode, tap on the info icon first, turn off low data mode, scroll down and tap on configure DNS. Now first of all, select the manual one if it's selected to automatic, delete the existing DNS servers in here, and to boost up the signal or speed, we're gonna use the Google DNS. Type in 8.8.8.8, tap on add server, and type in 8.8.4.4. And don't forget to save it. Now, if you keep having this problem, if not frequently, but every now and then, what you need to do is just go ahead, reset the network settings on your device once. Go ahead, open up settings, from there to general, Scroll down till the end to transfer a reset iPhone to reset and then just go ahead reset network settings on your device. Just make sure you have the Wi-Fi password so that it can reconnect after the network reset is done. All the process or any combination we have shown you so far is enough to solve any Wi-Fi issues on your iPhone XR. Thanks for watching.